Love this matchup, T.O. I think the first four minutes can tell us a lot about the pace of this game with these two teams. Well, I think right out of the gate, what you're going to see is Bellerman is going to swing that ball from side to side whenever they do retain possession. Talked about Chase Hunter in the open. He's been facilitating there. A nice feed. And Middlebrooks misses. Gets the follow. Ben Middlebrooks with the first bucket of the night. Hunter Tyson, a very good rebounder there. A lazy pass. Here's Suter on the break. And he ties the score. And Suter, like I mentioned, zero points in their opener, 23 and 24 in the second and third contest. Here comes Chase Hunter. He's so good on the break, making good decisions. He's going to fire a three, knocks it down. In the corner, Ben Johnson. Deep three, good. Justin Betts knocks it down, the grad student. But he's a big switchable guard, really gets up, forces turnovers at a high rate for Bellarmine. Tigers, a lot of ball fakes early, and then the three, like that one from Tyson. A little bit like Virginia, and Bellarmine, as they move the basketball, the slowest team in the country, as far as tempo is concerned, but it doesn't matter if Kurt, Kurt Hopf is going to be able to knock down shots as well. Tigers go ultra big and look to dominate on the boards a little bit more. Nice little hook. Look at that move by Justin Betts to the baseline. Justin Betts going old school. They come out, they get you in the post. And then because they use some of their length at the guard spot, inverting their offense, if you will. Hemingway gets the shooter's roll. The guy who puts in as much work as him, he's going to get the benefit of the doubt with the rim on some of those. B.J. Hall with the deflection. Tigers looking to run here. Chase oh. Hunter, no look feed to Shefflin. Now 16 assists to three turnovers for a guy who really is more of a combo guard. There's an answer, three. I like legging more. It's coming up towards Christmas, big leggings guy. <laughs> <laughs> Make a note, three on the way, knocked down. And just like that, we're tied as Ben Johnson rips the cord. And that one wasn't that close to the three-point line, Qualk. P.J. Hall looking to respond. Yes, sir. Top of the key is his spot. Great start if you like sharpshooting, which I would say both of your broadcasters do. There's another one. How about Hatton getting into the act? Somebody that's going to have to grow into a bigger role because he's not quite ready yet. But when you're that big and that skilled, there are times you're going to have success as Hunter Tyson knocks down another one. Tyson three, good give across the floor from Wiggins. Hunter Tyson always moving with his hands in position, ready to fire one. Knights down four. Deep three straight away. Knocked down. Beautiful stroke from Sam DeVault. How about that? He's on the paw. That's Terrence Oglesby range right there. Bounce pass to the block. Suter up in traffic. Gets it to go. Suter be at 6'5 and pretty broad shoulders. He can get over top of somebody like Galloway who's more 6'2", 6'3", range, but Alex Hemingway can't leave him open. That's what happens. And they continue to be in the right position. Defensively have been pretty good, but you have to take care of the ball. That's a big time block shot by P.J. Hall. I thought Wake Forest in the Atlantic Coast was a tournament team, but they scheduled so weak during the non-con, it really come back, came back to bite them. Are you calling that game? Clemson Towson. The Bellarmine Knights, they're capable of making shots, six in the first half. But at the same time, make sure that you stay disciplined for the duration of the clock. And if they're going to make shots like that, like Bash Whelan. Super shot for Whelan. He's got the first five of the second half. Tigers reversing the ball. Galloway, a hanger. Tigers back on top. Ball's on the deck, and Betts has it. Suter missed it. The tap back is good. And I actually think Hunter Tyson was the one who tipped that ball in. At least you knew your role. Chase Hunter, another skip pass to Tyson. He just sees it so well, Walk. And that's something that I'm not sure he developed as much during his time in college, but it's something that he had coming here. But he's now that he's led... Chase Hunter, five assists in the game today, and a good pass there to Galloway. And how about Galloway getting his feet set? Shows Clemson's defensive presence. 
Again, we talked about a halftime. Clemson plus nine in points off turnovers. And how about Tipton? They have not led. This game has been tied now five different times. Nice cut. They can lead. Whelan delivers. He's got nine. Both of these teams' efforts defensively, I mean, they stay after it, and they're continuously alert. That's a big-time move by Peter Suter. And that's not an easy thing to teach a lot of freshmen is patience. Tough shot from Tyson, and the rebound batted to Galloway. The floater in the lane, and the Tigers back on top. And Meadowbrook's just using his strength on the interior. Nice play. Now the double team's coming. You have to recognize where it's going to come for him. And nice move, the big fella from Florida. It's been a physical game, Falk. If you look around the floor, guys are bleeding. Alex Hemingway's got a big patch of blood. That is a physical move. How about Peter Suter flicks it to the bench, baby? One point game, where's the ball go? Inside out from P.J. Hall, Chase Hunter. Gets the roll. That's where he's made that step. Peg Hunter Tyson is 30 years old. P.J. Hall, a grown man junior. And he had a shot over both of them. Lefty three. Yes, sir. Tigers on the break. Shefflin. And that is another rim run. Shefflin getting out in transition. And that's where he poses a different threat than P.J. Scramble on the floor. Shefflin gets rid of it to Chase Hunter. Three on three. Chase will do it himself. Wow. <laughs> Even he was shocked. Look where Clemson's gotten their points here in the recent possessions. Playing with pace, getting out and running a little bit, and then making quick decisions. And Eden Shefflin, a grown man move. Hemingway looking for a three, finds it. Hunter, lob inside. Another paint finish for the Tigers. Putting him in screen and rolls with a lot of room to operate. Galloway, strong move and finish. That's a big time move. But I, I think I counted seven or eight times where they've just hit every part of the rim and out. Hunter, that's an exclamation point. Three of the five players on the floor right now for Bellerman have hit threes today. And Whelan wasn't one of them. That's his first three-point make and a five-point possession and a timeout with 138. See if the Knights can finish on a positive note here. This is a gritty win, Qualk. I mean, for Clemson to be able to get this, but to be able to maintain your focus. There's a three-minute slip-up at the beginning of the second half. After that, I mean, you have to applaud their effort off the ball, their intensity. This is a much better win than I think people realize.